Boom. Ooh. Bam. Ooh. Oh. Bop. Pow. What's good, YouTube? You already know who it is, man. It's your boy. The way, man, man, man. We back at it like crack at it. You already know how we rocking, man. Stop playing with me. Stop playing with me. Stop playing with me. And today, we had to come with that Quavo. What'd you say? That Quavo. What'd you say? That Quavo. All right, we got to wrap this up, though. Okay. Oh, my bad. My bad. I'm trying to jump. I didn't wrap hear it up then. Ooh. Down. Uh, that way. Uh, that way. Uh, that way. Da this way, man. The Wave Channel way. You already know how we rocking, man. Look. I'm going to just go ahead and give y'all what y'all been asking for, man. Quavo featuring Offset featuring Takeoff. Go ahead, Takeoff. You feel me? Now, I know what y'all asking. I don't even want y'all to ask me the question. I know what y'all asking. Mr. Waveman, why do you have the sleeping mask on? Mr. Waveman. Let me tell y'all why. I'm going to tell you right now. Look, us as a Wave Gang community, YouTube is sleeping on us. So I'm telling these boys to wake these boys up. Wake these boys up. Whenever y'all see these, wake these boys up, man. Spam it up. Wake them up. We the most lit gang on YouTube. Stop playing with me. You know how you rocking. If you're new to Wave Game, make sure you guys subscribe. I want you guys to thumbs up this video and comment, man. Stop playing with me. Stop playing with me. Stop playing with me. Make sure you guys follow me here at QDARUBO on Instagram and Twitter, man. You already know how we rocking, man. Now, we're going to get right into this. First things first, I got to get my shout outs. You know how I'm rocking, man. Look. So my first shout out goes to Joshua.Done, man. That don't gonna pop up on the screen right that way. You feel me? Wave channel way. And the next person I want to shout out, YMP Music, man. Shout out to y'all, man. Y'all already know. If you want a shout out, go to my Instagram. <laughs> and go ahead, comment on the picture. Something real litty. You feel me? Real litty. All right, let's get into this, man. I ain't gonna hold y'all. Before we get into this, though, I gotta say, Celeb produces beat, man. Links are in the description, man. Go shop with the kid. He's, he's a beast. Stop playing with him, hey. Let's get right into this thing. Look, this is what we gonna get into today, man. Listen to this, man. Gave her day last night. Now she walking funny. Walk fast. Hey, she wanna pipe, but she keep running from it. Running from it. She claim I'm too nice, but she know that I'm front. Sachi friends for nothing. She know that I'm stunned. Freezer on Rocky. Got that pocket rocket on me. Popping Willis Kawasaki. Church shit on pop. You gotta roll the dice. Roll the My diamonds overpriced. Over my diamonds overpriced. Price. My diamonds overpriced. Over Michael Jackson on my neck. That black and white diamonds. Protect on my wrist. So that's enough for y'all right there, man. Y'all hear what we're about to get into, man. Let's get right into it, man. All right. So the first thing you guys gotta understand about the Migos, period, man. A lot of the, uh, a lot of what makes the Migos, the Migos is their ad libs. You know? Trick, trick is dot dot dot. Hey, gang, bop, my set. We got. You know what I'm saying? It's like nowadays music has come so far, far forward. I'm not sure or far backwards, but music's come far in, in one of the directions. You feel what I'm saying? So what I'm saying is basically in today's music, a lot of the ad libs are more, you know, apparent in the track than even the verses. Like, so with the Migos, one of the main things these guys uh, are known for are their triplet flows and their uh, ad libs. So that's one thing. If you don't know what a triplet flow is, go look it up. People will teach you. Um, and ad libs, you already know what that is. So we're gonna get right into it, man. First things first with Quavo and uh, you know just the Migos in general, they use uh, auto tune. So the first thing we did was we got the auto tune. So for this beat, the auto tune is D flat. All right, D flat major. And I also went here and put it to alto tenor. And we did a retune speed of zero, and we did a humanize of zero as well. Reason being because though. You know, with the sound, with rap being very melodic these days, auto-tune is heavily added to assist, you know what I'm saying? So, for Quavo, Offset, whoever you want, like, they put them uh, that auto-tune up, you know what I'm saying? So, that way, the zero way, you feel me? And like I like I said, um, your auto-tune is based solely on the beat that you're giving, and by the beat that you're giving, you should be in a, 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 a relative key, you know what I'm saying? So... It's up to you to know what key you're supposed to use your vocal instrument as. And basically, this is just here to assist you be uh, pitch perfect or correct your vocal vocal corrections. All right, next thing we did, we got a Maximus, and we used this to get the uh, de -esser. 
first of all, I'll play this without the auto tune so you guys can hear without the auto tune and with the auto tune. Main vocal alone. Gave her day last night, now she walking funny. Claim she want a pipe, but she keep running from it. She claim I'm too nice, but she know that I'm frontin'. Sachi friends for nothing. She know that I'm stunned. So y'all hear the difference, man. It's just something sub like something subtle, but at the same time it adds it, it adds to the whole sound. If it's, it's, you almost don't have the sound if you're not using auto tune these days. That that really can that's just how it is these days. Simple. It's either you keep up with it or get lost. But you don't want to get lost in the sauce. So if you don't got no sauce, then you are lost. Mm -hmm. But you also get lost in the sauce. So, next what we did was we got the Maximus and we used this just for uh, de -esser. So what you do is you go to the preset and you get the de narrow narrowband and you click that right there, you feel me? Straight like that. Next thing you wanna do is you wanna get a parametric EQ. Now, one of the main things that I hear when I'm listening to the Migos is their vocals are very present. It is not the, it's crazy though because like their vocals still full, you know what I'm saying? So the thing what I did is listening to their vocals and with the uh, equipment that I'm working with, this is what I had to do. Basically, I cut it off at 116, uh, a high pass cut, and I uh, did a cut also at 233 hertz. Uh, this is about my you know bass range. Uh, what you want to do is you just basically want to go up here and you scan. As you listen to your vocal, you want to scan. So. Gave her then that night, now she walking funny. Claim she want a pipe, but she keep running from it. She claimed I'm too nice, but she know that I'm Now I know you guys heard that difference. That's a big difference. So basically what you want to do when you're EQ and keep rule of mind is you want to take out more than you boost. You feel me? Facts. Next thing I did, I uh, took out as well, you know, did a peak down at 530. That's uh, usually in the 500 ranges where you start to get that boxy sound in your vocal. So that's, that's one of the things you want to listen to. Same thing you'll do. You'll just sweep, frequency sweep, same thing. And next thing we did, like I said, the Migos vocals are very present. So what I did was I uh, boosted in the 4K area and I also boosted in the 9K. With and without. Gave her dead last night, now she walking funny. Claim she want to pop. You guys hear it, the simplest day. Y'all already know how I'm rocking. All right, look, next thing I did, I got a compressor. What I did was, first thing I did was I moved the ratio to eight to one. This is one of the smoothest ratios I like to work with. You feel what I'm saying? Next thing I did was I basically took the ratio, the uh, threshold from zero all the way to about 30. Gave her last night, now she walking funny. Claim she want up. As you guys can hear, it just slowly got the dynamic range in order. You know what I'm saying? You don't want to smash the vocals and kill them because then you have no vocal range. Then you're going to be asking why your vocals sound dull, why your vocals sound flat, all type of crazy stuff hitting my comments, talking all crazy and my stuff. Like, no, listen to what I'm saying now to save yourself time later. You feel what I'm saying? Let's get back into this blank thing. You already know how I'm rocking, man. Look, after that, man, we got another parametric EQ. I, I really don't know what I just did. So let me go ahead and switch this. EQs before compressors. You want to get rid of your frequencies before you compress them. Why would you want to come? When you see this vocal chain, this is actually a vocal chain. So think about the order you're putting things in. Now, you can break rules. I'm not telling you guys there's, there's rules. To... Do what you want to do. You feel me? All I'm saying is I'm not about to compress no bad frequencies. It don't make no type of sense. You feel me? All right. So I'm back into the blank thing. You feel me? So parametric EQ, the second one. I boosted in a 12K just to give it more presence because like I said, when you hear these dudes' vocals, these these dudes' vocals cut the most, I think. In music right now, their vocals cut the most. Shout out to their engineer, man. I don't know who do it. Shout out to them, though. Facts. All right, next thing we did, we got the Sound Godizer. Now, what I did with this is I use C. Main reason, just, just to bring the fullness back into the voice as well as keep that presence, you feel what I'm saying, in the midtones. So I use preset C at about one-fourth the uh, you know, way around the knob. So uh, I'll play this with and without it. Gave her day last night, now she walking funny. Claim she want a pipe, but she keep running from it. She claim I'm too. Now I know you guys can clearly hear like, it goes from, can I have my lunch, honey? To, 
Give me your lunch money. You feel me? Straight like that. You already know how I'm rocking. So sound good eyes are uh again. I use preset C. Now, this is a third party plugin. This is called D Breather. Now, there's other ways you can do this, but I'm gonna show you basically what this does is Clancy, Wanda, uh-uh, 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 uh-uh. Pause. On these pauses in between your next sentence, what it does is it's like a gate. So what it does is it literally mutes everything. You might have background noise going on. You might have anything. Simple breathing. That's going to be all cut out with this called, called, with this. It's called a deep breath. You feel what I'm saying? So many of you guys might not have this. So the next best option would be to do simply this. What you want to do is you get a slice tool and you simply go in and slice in between your raps. Gave her day last night, now she walking funny. Can she want a pipe, but she keep running from it. Now what that does, it gives you the Migo sound. Like this is the little things that make the difference though. I'm telling you guys. A couple other people do this type of thing, like Party Next Door. I'll go more into that soon. Party Next Door tutorial coming up. Another re-up. You know how I'm rocking. If you, ha if you haven't heard my song, re-up, go check that joint out on SoundCloud, by the way. But I wasn't talking about that. I'm just saying you're going to get a part two of the Party Next Door. Song. But just besides the topic, you know what I'm saying? Basically, what I'm saying is the breath in between a vocal can and really change the sound. So what I'm saying is the Migos take that out. So for me, I can use this. It's a third-party plugin. It does not come with FL Studios, but it does the same thing. If you don't have this, simply do what I just told you guys to do, and it will be the same thing. Okay, next thing we did was got a Fruity Reverb, and we just threw up the wetness. And we used the Subbus, what I like to call Subbus. What this basically does is puts the amount of the effect onto the vocal. And I have it around here, so you guys know what that does. It's Reverb. Nothing dry on my side, my guy. <laughs> get it. Let's get back into it. You feel me? I'm, I'm, I'm unfocused. Now we're going to get into these background vocals. Let's listen to the background vocals with and without the main vocal. Gave her day last night. Now she walking funny. Walking funny. Can she want a pipe, but she keep running. Running funny. Yeah. Skr -skr. Stop. As you guys can hear, man, these are some of the infamous, most greatest ad-libs ever known to the rap history culture, man. Hey, their album is called Culture for a reason, man. They changing it up, man. Big shout out to the Migos and all that, 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 this, that, and third. You already know how I'm, you know, how, you, know how, you already know how I'm rocking. But let's get into it, man. I'm going to be honest with you guys. Literally, I copied the same main vocal to this ad-lib track, guys. I don't know if you guys listen close enough, but when you listen to the Migos, their ad libs are just as present and as same mixing as the main vocal. Just a little turn down, but that's the Migos for you guys. It's the same. It's like the same. So peep. Gave her last night. Now she walking funny. Walking fast. Can she want a pipe? Go listen to Amigos song right now and tell me any different. Tell me something different. Go listen to Amigos song right now. But like I said, man, it's the same thing as the main vocal. Except for the deep breather, because I didn't feel like putting it on. Simple as that. You want to say something? Go ahead. I don't care. But you like I was like I was saying. You know what I'm saying? Only thing different is I just moved up the reverb a little bit, just just to put it a little bit more in the background. But hey, that's all it is right there, guys. Hey, they sleep on us. Stop. They sleep on us. Stop playing with me. Stop playing with me. Stop playing with me. Tell them stop sleeping on the wave gang. We don't play them games. You feel me? Now that's it right there for you guys, man. Nice short and sweet. Tutorial man, look, that's the Migos for y'all. That's the Quavo. That's that offset takeoff. You already know. I want to thank everybody for watching the video, man. I want you guys to make sure you subscribe. Make sure you thumbs up this video. Make sure you comment, man. Stop playing with me. Hey, you already know how we end these. Denzels. Gave her day last night. Now she walking funny. Walking fast. Hey, she want a pipe, but she keep running from it. Running from it. She claim I'm too nice, but she know that I'm front. Sachi friends for nothing. She know that I'm 